Hello, I'm going to do a quick video on this. I wasn't expecting to. I kind of didn't want to, to be honest, but I feel it's a necessity. So uh, I'm pretty sure that pretty much everybody's heard of the Keaton Jones story, the bullying kid. Like, uh, there isn't many that haven't heard about this. And uh, yeah, so I'm going to cover this a little bit. But first, just a, a little clip of what's going on here. Just out of curiosity, why do they bully? What what's the point of it? Why do you find joy in taking innocent people and finding a way to be mean to them? It's not okay. What do they say to you? They call me they make fun of my nose. They call me ugly. They say I have no friends. What'd they do to you at lunch? Put milk on me and put hand down my clothes, threw bread at me. Is it just you? Yep. Or is it other kids, too, that feel that way? Say it's other kids, too. How's that make you feel? I don't like that they do it to me, and I for sure don't like that they do it to other people, because it's not okay. People that are different don't need to be criticized about it, because it's not their fault. But if you are made fun of, just don't. Don't let it bother you. Stay strong, I guess. It's hard. But it'll probably get better one day. Now I wanted to point out a few things. A bunch of people jumped the fucking gun. And it irritates the living shit out of me. Somebody set out uh, and did a GoFundMe campaign. None of the family members did it. Somebody did, which means y'all got scammed. And everybody believed that that was the family. So you all got scammed too for being fucking stupid and jumping the gun. Secondly, some other people thought, oh, his mom did Confederate flags. Well, that makes her racist, right? Oh, she must be a racist because she likes the Confederate flag then these people are racist too. Oh, that's right. No, they're not racist. They're, what? what's the term that you dumb motherfuckers use? Uncle Toms or Coons? Race traitors? That's, that's the term you're using? Race traitors? Fuck all y'all. Seriously. You, you're, you're really messed up. You are really messed up. My boy, have a good smell. Finally, I want to get down to the root of it. I am, uh, I'm irritated by this video. Because I've been in his shoes, and I don't like it. I was bullied. I don't appreciate it. And I didn't like it when it happened to me. I don't like it when it happens to others. I hate bullies. Hate them. So when I saw some videos that are reactionary videos saying, Oh no, he wasn't bullied. He was the bully because his mom likes white supremacist stuff. Even though it's not. Things, right? And yes, it looks like that that kid might be the one who's being bullied. But as we're getting more and more information about him and his family, we see that this little bastard most likely was be was the bully and not being bullied. And this is classic psychopathic white behavior. Seriously, what what the fuck's wrong with you people? Um, I really hope this kid turns out better than the rest of you. 
because y'all are pathetic motherfuckers that think this kid's racist because his mom likes things that you don't like. Bullies that pick on you may have some things going on in their own lives. They may know how to bully themselves, bully others because they too are being bullied in some way. But sometimes, especially when they're males, they don't stop just because you ignore them. And the fact that he got this much attention out of these assholes bullying him, they're going to use this as a point to say, look, I got you all famous because I kicked your ass. It's not going to stop. He needs to learn how to toughen up, and he needs to learn how to fight back. Dragon Styles Agile. It's in the mind. Snake Styles Mysterious. It's in the heart. Styles vicious with strength. Green Styles direct with purpose. I think the only ones that really wanted to teach him anything is uh, Dana White put something out. Although, with the way that some of the UFC little assholes are responding, I wouldn't be surprised if they rescinded that offer as well, based on lies and false assumptions. But I really, I, I really hate bullies. I hate them to the core, mainly because I was almost stabbed by my bully. Let that sink in if you think it's fun to be bullied. You've never experienced it yourself, probably, if you're running your mouth off like some of these assholes. That's all I had to say about this one. I know it's short and sweet. Um, it's not very philosophical, but this really got under my skin after I looked at all the facts, took back, and sat and waited. I watched the video itself, and uh, he's been in my shoes. And they ain't going to stop. It'll, it'll get better when you leave high school. And go to college when people don't care. If you go to college. Otherwise, you need to learn to stand up for yourself. Because it won't stop until then. That's all I got. Thanks. Alright. What are you all looking at?